like. Um, I'm just here to play today. So I'm gonna show you guys a quick tutorial on the Ponyo and how to put it in properly. Um, so I'm gonna just do it all up real fast. So here we go. And again, you guys, if you have styles you wanna do, you let me know in the comments and I will do that. But I'm gonna start with the ponytail. Okay, here we go. All right, so you just put your hair up to the desired height. I like it to be super high. So I'm gonna put it kind of on top of my head because it's just my style. Um, that's what I like to do. I think it's cute. Okay. And what you do guys, two fingers. You want your pointer and your thumb. Someone said like baby shark, which I thought was really cute. So that's kind of a good way to remember it. So baby shark, everyone. You grab your hair with your pointer and thumb. Feed your hair through the ponyo, keeping it super close to your head guys. So like, don't let it come up. Just keep it glued to your head. And then you're gonna squash it flat, okay? And I like to have it spread out. So I kind of like spread the hair out to the ends to make it even, to make the bends really good and sharp. So we're gonna turn around and it, you put your thumb on the ponyo, grab your other thumb and wrap the ponyo around your thumb. Do the same thing on the other side. So we're gonna wrap it around. The tighter and sharper these bends, the more secure your ponytail is going to be. Make sure they're tight, secure, and boom. We have like ponytail for days, guys. Look at the height on that and the width. It's like both, it looks like extensions. Like it's insane how big your hair can get with the ponytail. So it looks like I've got 10 times the hair that I have. I have very fine, thin hair. I'm gonna try to read everything you guys are saying right now. I've, no, I've missed a couple of things. If I don't get to it, you guys let me know and just re-comment because uh, while I was styling, I didn't see everyone. La la la. Okay, I'm gonna do, um, let me show you guys a really cute top knot with it. Is that it's gonna give you a base to wrap your hair around. So for the buns, it makes the buns look thicker and bigger. My hair's um, long and thick, but it still work. If your hair is long and thick, you get the XL. Um, the XL is going to be bigger so that you can pull through easier and make those bends. So you want the XL. Okay. And so let's do the top knot. So what I'm going to do is kind of twist my hair a little bit. Boom, boom, boom. So you have like a nice little twist and you just take your fingers and I just wrap it around. And again, look how thick it makes your bun look like it makes it higher because it gives that stance which is really nice uh well it stayed during a crazy workout i work out in mine all the time guys like it doesn't move i'll show you guys a couple jumps here in a second after i show you all my top knot and then i just tuck it and squeeze and boom and this is more for chill so you, if you want it to be like super secure if you are going to work out with a bun pin it um just to give it that extra security but yeah here's a cute little top knot so easy so fast uh, done in like a couple seconds. So, um, blah, blah, blah. okay, yeah. So let me take this out and I'm gonna do some jumping for you so you can kind of see that it's not, I'm gonna be weird and just jump around. So here we go. So I'm gonna fling it. It's going nowhere, guys. It is staying secure. <laughs> so for your viewing pleasure, I am being crazy. Okay. So anything else you guys want to see, I can do a bun bar. I know some of you guys have a bun bar. They're amazing. Um, let me show you. So I, you typically want to use your 2.0 for that. So, and what's nice about this is, boom, no damage and it comes right out. So it's not like ripping my fine thin hair out, which I need all the hair I can get. So if any comes out, then it's like a tragedy for me. Um, and so let me show you guys the bun bar. It's super easy, super fast. So I use our 2.0, it is the, oh, it's the thinner version. So you can see how it's a little, it's not as bulky, it's a little bit thinner. Um, and what I'm gonna do is just put my hair up like I normally would. I'm gonna do it pretty high so y'all can really see what I'm doing. Um, la, la, la. If you're just too small for your hair, um, then get, size up. Um, definitely get the size up for that. If you have super thick hair, uh, I definitely recommend the XL for sure. Okay, so, boop. Again, I'm gonna do it pretty high. You can do a really cute low bun, guys. We have military girls who do like the low military bun, which is really pretty as well. Um, again, my style, my personal style is high. That's just kind of what I like. Um, 
So that's kind of what I always demonstrate, but I should give you guys a little bit more of a variety. <laughs> okay, so again, baby shark guys, pointer, thumb, boom. We are going to feed the hair through, keeping it close to our head. It's gonna do the same process as your original pony. Okay, we're gonna squash it flat, and then we're gonna do those sharp individual bends. We're gonna bend it around my thumb. So my thumb's on the back of it. I'll show you here. Where that side's done, and then we're gonna bend it around. Sharp, and you don't want this to open. You want it to stay tight, okay? Something you never wanna do with the pony, and still, like, even with the 2.0 guys, it's like really cute height still. It's still higher than it would be with a hair tie, so that's pretty cool. Love the red color. Dude, the red is one of my favorites. I didn't expect to love the, so the blue is awesome as well. Look at the blue. It's so freaking pretty. And I didn't realize how much blue I owned in my wardrobe. So I've been wearing this one a lot. The red's sick too. I love them all. Okay. So let's show you guys. I don't know if it's too small. It, you, if it doesn't, if your hair, okay, this is the thing. So if your hair is, when you put it up and you're like holding your hair in a ponytail, if it is the size of a golf ball, like when you're holding it up, that means you need the XL. That means it's like, it's too thick for the original. If it's the size of a quarter, dime, anything smaller than that, original's fine for you. So try that out. Um, that's kind of a good like measure of how to um, get the sizing for you. Okay, so let's see. So I'm gonna show you guys this real fast because I could talk all day. So this is open on one side, closed on the other. What you're gonna do is take your hair. Hold on. There we go. Take your hair, take the bun bar. You're gonna center your hair in the bun bar, okay? You're gonna hold it like a bicycle handle. And I think this is where a lot of people have trouble. So this is gonna be super helpful if you do have the bun bar. Um, what you're gonna do is hold it like a bicycle handle, go up to the shortest layer. And here's the trick. I'm like really bent over, guys. Uh, here's the trick. I'm getting a leg workout in. You're gonna want to roll towards your head. Don't roll backwards. You're gonna roll forward towards your forehead. So I'm gonna roll forward. See how I'm going forward towards my head? Boom, hit your head. Then we're gonna turn around and I'm gonna overlap the bun bar, okay? So you're gonna overlap and give it a really good squash. Like the tighter you squeeze, the more secure it's gonna be, guys. So like just squash the crap out of your bun bar. Squash, it's not gonna break, give it a good squash. So once you squash, we're gonna take our little claw crabbers, whatever, and wrap it around. Oh, let me show you from here. So we're gonna wrap it around. Boom. And again, give it that extra squash. Always squash at the end. So boom, we have the cutest bun. Ooh. And you can play with it, which is nice. So I've got these little hairs hanging out. You can always just kind of tuck that down. And then what, if you want it bigger, so I love, the bigger the better for me. So what I do is take my fingers, give it some tuggies. Tug, 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 and look at this freaking bun, guys. It's huge, huge. And again, I have super fine thin hair, and you never know it. Okay, but you always, at the end, like I said, squash it. Squash at the end, so once you have it the, how big you like it, you're gonna go boop, and that just gets the bun together and makes it perfect. I probably would have brushed out better, so yeah. But, I mean, the bun, that's what we're looking at, this. And it's cute AF. So, okay, I need to read you guys what you're saying. Uh, blah, let's see. You have a quarter size and it doesn't hold. Well, there may be some tricks and tips that I can give you. I, we do do, uh, do, we do, okay, Shannon. We do uh, FaceTime sessions. So I'm actually right now doing them. So if you want to schedule one, email us and I can personally watch you do it and help you put it on correctly. Um, where do I order? You order on online. We're just sold online. We are not on Amazon. We're not on any other websites. So we're at ponio.com. So www.ponio.com and you will get our official product. And they are patented. So if you guys see anything on Amazon, anywhere else, they are cheap knockoff versions that break really easily. So I really recommend going with our website. We, our customer service is amazing. We will help you in any way. Like I said, we'll even FaceTime you. So yes, we love you and we genuinely care. <laughs> and we know our product works. So 
we stand behind it completely. Oh. Okay, so anything else you guys wanna see? I, okay, yeah, just again, go ahead and um, message us and we can do a FaceTime and I can kinda help, help you uh, to where it stays all day and it's comfortable. So yes, just go ahead and message us, uh, customer service. Or you can DM us, cause they'll send you that way too. Um, anything else guys, is there any other styles? I could do a low, I think, a messy bun. Okay, I love the messy buns, they're fun. Okay, so let's do that. Ah, uh, blah, 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 we'll just do the blue, why not? Cause it's kind of my favorite. All right. I just saw something about FaceTimes. Yes, face the FaceTimes are free. <clears throat> and again, it's gonna be with me. So you can hang out with me and talk to me for a bit. Um, okay, so messy bun. Two fingers, point your thumb, boom. Slide your hair through the top. And I'm just gonna go ahead and pull it all the way through, okay? There's so many different buns you can create with this, but I'm gonna do kind of like the messy bun that I like. Um, okay, and they bend, bend. All right. And this one's so secure, guys. So the one that I'm about to do, you can work out in and it won't go anywhere. So let me get this guy. So I'm gonna get my 2.0. I'm looking all American here. Um, and I'm gonna get this a little extra squashy. I'm gonna make it kind of touch because I'm gonna layer this on top. So what I'm gonna do, yes, you can definitely, uh, again, message us and um, we can schedule you guys a FaceTime if you need any help. So I'm always here. Um, Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and do the wrap. So you wrap it around. You take your 2.0, and then I'm gonna just shove my hair through the top. Okay, so just shove, shove, shove. Get it all the way out. And this is like my messy, messy bun. So it's kind of like a little wild, but that's kind of the style these days. It's like fun, messy, and then I kind of pinch it, and boom, it is like going nowhere. It's my messy, quarantine bun and I just think it's cute and it's so secure <laughs> it's going nowhere so yes that's one of my favorite buns um again if there's any other styles you want let me know I'm gonna go and take this one out no hair guys so there's no damage to your natural hair it's not gonna rip your hair out which is my favorite part because I don't have any hair so the more hair the better okay so open, open, and it just slides right out. Boom. And I still have like a cute curl, like it's not, it's not creasing my hair, which is nice. So it just gives me, I can go back to being long and not, and hot, I guess again, because I'm in Texas and it's hot. So I wear my hair up all the time. I don't know where all you guys are. Drop where you're at, because I would love to see uh, where all of you guys are from. Uh, what about, Thick, natural, curly hair. Yes, go on our profile. We have so many uh, different hair types. We are really diversifying. You guys have seen a lot of me on social media. I'm getting away from me, guys. We're gonna, we have different people. We've got different hair types. We have different hair styles. So we have different textures, everything. So we have diversified in that way and we're so excited about it because I've had fun filming. I've been doing a lot of filming lately. Um, UK, cool. Louisiana, not Chicago. Phoenix, you guys are from everywhere. California, well, good to meet all of you. I'm Texas. That's actually my mother-in-law. <laughs> Hi, mom. Um, so what does the product do? Okay, I'll do another ponytail for sure. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys the original ponytail for when anyone who's just now tuning in so you can get kind of a proper UK cool. There's a lot of UK, Vegas, nice. Boston, you guys are all awesome. Okay, so Indiana. I've never been to Indiana. I should probably go. Well, when quarantine's done. When all this craziness is done. Finland! That's so cool! Okay, so this is what our product is. This is called the Ponyo. And um, we, it's non-damaging, it's not stretchy, it is um, bendy. So there's no stretch to it at all. Um, which makes it not damage your hair because the stretchy ones, it pulls so tight that it just like breaks those little hairs. So this evenly distributes your hair and makes it very comfortable and okay so what we're doing <laughs> god guys feed your hair through keeping it close to your head okay so feed your hair through keep it close to your head squash your ponyo completely flat you want even distribute to distribute your hair evenly in the ponyo so you want it to be all distributed evenly so the bends are even so 
once it is evenly distributed, I'm going to show you the bends. The bends is the most important part at Lebanon. That's amazing. Um, so what you're gonna do is, I'm gonna turn around. Okay, so take your thumb and your other thumb. So take your thumb and put it on the ponio on the end. You're gonna take your other thumb and wrap the ponio around your other thumb. So same on the other side. Boom. Did I miss a hair? I did miss a hair. Huh. Oh well. Okay. Let that guy hang. Uh, and so now you have a cute, high, perfect, perky ponytail that's going nowhere. It's comfortable. It's light. And again, it's distributing the hair weight. So your hair is not going to be pulling and it's not going to damage your hair, which is really nice. If you do want height up top, just take your fingers and just kind of tug and you get that like little volume, like 1950s volume like that. So yeah, that's it. Okay guys, this was so fun. I've missed y'all. I feel like I haven't been on here in forever. Um, which size, okay, I wanna buy, but I don't know which size is better for long, thick hair. Long, thick hair, okay. I would recommend if you have super thick hair, like thicker than normal people, we go with XL. So we did create the XL original for you so that it will hold your hair, pull your hair through, and you can actually make those sharp individual bends, which are very important with ponyo. So if you have thick, long hair, XL. If you have thin hair, you do, which I, oh, thin, I'm sorry, thin, thin, like me, you do the um, original. You can do the original ponyo. It's gonna work perfectly for you, that's what I have. So this is the original, and then um, you can also do the, the 2.0, that's more for half up, um, which is really pretty as well. I'll show you guys a real quick half up um, with the 2.0. So the 2.0 is more for sectioning sections of hair. I don't usually do it for all up, but you can. Um, I got them and it's not working for you. Um, go ahead, um, message. You're the best girlfriend, you're the best. Uh, go ahead and message us um, and we can set up a FaceTime. Again, I do the FaceTime, so you'll be talking to me. Uh, for now, that's why I'm, I'm kind of helping out in that way. So uh, yeah, we can talk. I can sh you can show me how you're putting it in. I All right, so I'm gonna do a quick half up look. So take my hair. So what's nice about the ponio too, is you don't have to pull, pull like as much hair up for the half up to make it look thick because it's gonna make it look thick no matter what which is nice so I can leave the like majority of my hair down so it looks like I have thick full hair down here which is super important to me some of you guys have like insane beautiful hair and I'm jealous and been talking to y'all and I'm, it's it's insane but I don't I have thin fine hair so again baby shark two fingers pull your hair through the top keeping it close to your head squash it flat so it's the same process as if it was all up. So we're going to do the two bends. So you're gonna bend and you're gonna bend. I honestly do use the original for half up often because I just like it. I think uh, the height is really nice. I mean, you still get that really crazy height with this, but yeah, that's what the two point is for. I have teal, hot, pink, flamingo. You have them all? Oh my gosh, we do have a mint. We, well, I don't know. If, I guess it's teal. Yeah, okay, that's teal. Okay, we'll work on it. We'll talk about it. Um, so we um, are in the process of looking at new prints as well. We have not got the order in yet, but it's it's a coming, and there may or may not be snake print on there. So just stay tuned. Uh, I want to show you guys real quick our bling ring. Uh, okay, so this is our bling ring. I'm obsessed with it. This is my favorite design. We have so many that are really cute too. This one's just more subtle in my opinion. You just, oh, it's stretchy and it's magnetic, so boom, okay? And what you're gonna do is wrap it, it around your pony and just connect the magnets. And you look like you've got like, like a hairstylist styled this and really it's just like adding the bling and it makes it just a dynamic look. And it's very, very like, Celeb, like all the celebs are wearing it. So, if you're into that <laughs> and being a little extra, because I'm extra, this is really good for you. Um, you've been emailing, but you haven't got a response. Please message us um, on Instagram. Then I know our emails. We have 
email after email. We are, we're, our customer service are all my friends and they are working their butts off trying to get to all the emails and everything. Um, my girl Kiki is on Instagram, so if you would like to message her, um, DM her, she's pretty quick about getting right back to you. Um, she can look up orders and things like that. Um, and UPS, guys, um, we, we've been having a lot of shipping issues. Um, they are just clogged down with uh, COVID, and it's just been a real mess there. They don't have enough employees, and so it's just, it's taken a lot longer. We are switched, we think we're doing a little switch um so hopefully everything starts getting smoother and covid's kind of settling down i hope and not going up that's another story we could talk about that later um so the glitter styles yeah and i know they're so fun look how freaking cute it is guys oh okay well i have blabbed and blabbed enough i guess if you guys can pony be full okay so the 2.0 can be used for full hair as well um it's not going to be as secure so it, oh, it will be secure it's not going to be as like I wouldn't work out in it all up and I do a low with it. Here, I'll show you. Take this out. Okay, so with the 2.0, I typically wear it low. I mean, I, I mean, it depends on how thick your hair is really. If you have, my daughter wears this all up for sure. And she's, what is she, four? She's four now, oh my God, she's four. Okay, I'm getting old. All right, so this is with the 2.0. So what you're gonna do, same process guys, same exact thing. So you do two fingers, slide your hair through, keeping it close to your head, squash it flat, and you're gonna make those sharp, deliberate bends in the ponio. And that's a low 2.0 look, which I definitely like. It's more sleek, it's a little bit more professional if you are in the workplace. Um, so yeah, you can definitely wear it all up. Um, you're nine years old, Holly! Nice to see you! That's amazing! Thank you for joining us today. Um, okay, I've ordered one and I'm anxious for it to get here. I know I'm anxious for you to get it. You will get it. It's coming. Um, we're just waiting on UPS, guys. But it's, it, we're literally doing everything in our power to get it out to you. We're getting them out within the next, I think, two days. So we're getting them out to you. It's, UPS that has to deliver it to, unfortunately. I wish I could deliver it to you uh, myself. I would, seriously. Um, okay, well, this has been so fun. Thank you guys for joining in. If you have any questions, please feel free to message us. Uh, again, if you need a FaceTime, you let me know. We can chat. Um, and I will talk to y'all soon. Hopefully next week I'll come back on. All right. Oh, space buttons. Okay, someone just slid in there. Um, Morg, awesome, Morgan. I'm, I'm assuming it's Morgan. Um, okay, I'll do some space ones real fast, and then we'll wrap her up. Okay, so, boom. All right, I think I'll do, should I do a high? I can do a high, let's do a high. Um, I actually need, let's see, I can do it with, we're gonna be funky and do two different colors. I have like all the different colors in from Merino. So, I'm gonna just take this and secure it just to get it out of my way to work on the space bun. So I'm just gonna do a bubble and just kind of secure it that way. Boom. Now I typically like part it and be like all fancy with it, but I'm just gonna show y'all real quick how to do the dang thing. So we are going to lift this up. There's lots of different ways to do it too. It's not just kind of like a one way situation. Like you could do the bun bar with it, with it and it's super cute. So I'm gonna do two fingers, guys. I'm gonna make pigtails. So high pigtails. Boom. Squash it flat. Sounded like Blue's Clues right there. Okay, so then you make your bends, bend, bend. And again, what's real cool about this is it makes, gives you again that base. So you're gonna wrap it around and your hair's gonna look thicker because you have that thing to wrap it around. I don't know if that makes sense. Okay. So you're gonna take it, you twist, just like you did before with the all up bun. And I'm gonna put my oops, put my finger here and just, oops, oh my goodness, there we go. And just wrap it around, wrap, wrap, wrap. And then I'm gonna give it a nice little tuck in my ponio and squash and boom. Look how cute, oh yeah, I think that's the best one I've ever done. Excuse me, I feel like I should be a Coachella. Okay, same thing, because I'm a dork, I'm sorry. Okay, same thing on the other side. So we're gonna do a 
pigtail. Okay. Do I squash the ponio flat when I'm um, not using it or keep it in a circle? That's a great question. So we recommend, you, well, for storage purposes, to squash it flat and have it flat just because um, it just stores better. But if you want to keep it in a circle, I think that's going to be best for it because it's not in a bend. So I typically have, I squash mine. I squash it flat because um, I don't have, I, I, it's storage so that I don't have like ponios just lying around. I've got too many, I guess. Um, but I, if, if you can keep it in a circle, I would. Okay, we're gonna bend, we're gonna bend. Boom, we're back in the pigtail stage. Ooh. If I wanna be like Britney Spears for Halloween, I'm thinking I need your pigtails. Okay, so we're gonna twist, put your finger, and wrap. Wrap, boom. Okay, and then you tuck. Tuck it under. And again, guys, I may be too old for this style because I am not the spring chicken I once was, but I'm going to pretend like I'm cool and I can wear this and that they already keep it. There we go. So this is Space Buds. It's very trendy right now. Um, you, can have, you can never have too many ponios, guys. It's absolutely true. Like every color. I wear every single color that we own or that we have. And I, I wear them constantly. So again, this was so fun. I really appreciate you guys tuning in. You let me know if you need anything from us. Um, my girl Kiki is the one who is on Instagram. So you can message her uh, if you would like to speak to me directly. Ask her and I will get right on it. So uh, you guys, it was fun. And I, hopefully I see you guys next week. Uh, and be safe out there, guys. It's a little crazy. But uh, hang in there. We'll get through it. All right. Talk to you all soon.